everyone, Creeper here, and it's election day, so I want to make a video. This is definitely going to be different than my last election day special. Today we're going to be covering the second episode of The New Norm. Now, I haven't covered The New Norm before, so there's a first episode, but we're not covering that here. We're just covering the second episode, but if, if this video somehow gets 1,000 views, I will make a video about the first episode of The New Norm. And if you haven't yet, you should probably go out and vote, preferably for Kamala Harris and Tim Walz, because as a Mexican-American, I don't want something bad to happen to me. If Kamala wins, we're out of here. If Trump wins, we're out of here. <laughs> okay, why would you use a rocket to get into Canada? There are plenty of other ways to get to Canada. So why bother to use a rocket? I understand this is a cartoon, but it seems to be relatively based on reality, at least the reality conservatives believe exists. So I don't understand why you would use a rocket to get to Canada. Also, what's even the point of going to Mars? What would that accomplish? No, they eat dogs and cats. I've never seen the statement that Republicans eat dogs and cats. That's just something I've never heard of. I would really like to know where this is coming from. Your side eats dogs and cats. Oh, you get it? Racism. Because Donald Trump used a racist lie that Haitian immigrants that came here to the United States legally, and they're lying about them being illegal immigrants, but it wouldn't matter either way, saying that they ate pets of people in Ohio because Donald Trump is so stupidly racist. He just can't help but be racist. Our guy just sings about it. They're eating the dogs. <laughs> Maybe we all can get along. That's not even Trump singing at all. Like the first part was him talking, but that's him talking in a remix. And then the rest of the song is not him singing. There, on the salt roof. Oh. Okay, now I just want to talk for a quick second about how this Trump looks nothing like how Trump actually does look like. DEI? Ah, uh, you get it? Because in the eye of conservatives, DEI just means minority. So therefore, a minority can only get hired by a company because of DEI. As we know, members of minority groups can just never achieve anything on their own. When they get into a position of power, they didn't put any effort into it and were just given it. I wonder what this button does. Okay, I just want to ask, why is this rocket Amazon themed and also looks like the rocket Jeff Bezos went up into space in. Because Jeff Bezos, the owner of Amazon, refused to endorse Kamala Harris. So why would it be on the Kamala Harris side? Now we're stuck here with you. We're stuck here with you. And they them. Communist my plan worked. They're destroying each other. Do these people not realize that the USSR fell like 30 years ago? Anyway, that's all I have to say about this. I don't really care about the rest of this stupid little episode. It's kind of interesting to see this takes so long to come out when it looks quite frankly awful. Like the new Hell of a Boss episode that I'm going to cover soon, trust me. That came out the same day and it looks so much better. Hell of a Boss doesn't even have the Russian government funding it like you do the new norm, which is interesting that you don't know Russian history when you're funded by the Russian government. That's kind of interesting. But on the other hand, Putin doesn't even know Russian history. But anyway, you're getting money from a foreign government. That's not happening to Hell of a Boss. So what's your excuse to why your thing looks horrible? Anyway, make sure you go out and vote. Creeper out. Socialism is when the government does stuff. And it's more socialism, the more stuff it does. And if it does a real lot of stuff, it's communism.